hi everyone and welcome back to my channel today we are looking at the 12 zodiac signs and I am going to kick off with uh, Pisces uh, Pisces this is a, a general reading it's not going to resonate with everyone so uh, please take from it what you will I have meditated on the cards before starting today um, and I also did my little bit of uh, Savant at the end which we'll, I'll read to you later on so for my lovely Pisces, let's have a look what uh, is in store for you for August. So let's turn over the first card and we have the Field of Dreams and number 21. So I'll just place that there for a second and I'll just take a moment to have a look and see what I pick up from this card. OK, I feel that August for some scenes out there it will be a time of celebration gathering in your harvest your hard work I feel that some of you um, you know could be sort of spending a nest egg um, treating family you know whether some people out there have uh, took retirement and it's now time to enjoy and you know reap what you've sown over the years so I'm picking up on some Pisces in that respect. Field of dreams, obviously, um, as I look closer to the card, I do see here quite a, a darker egg. So I'm going to say like it's a black egg. Um, and I pick here now with some Pisceans, to be careful in the workplace where as you get on with your work etc I do feel to be aware that someone is talking behind your back I can see this sort of person whispering behind your back and obviously you're there you know sort of uh, oblivious really to what's going on and having the dark crows circling behind you know that to me even more of a message to say just be careful um, regards somebody at work. You may be aware that there's somebody making your life a misery at work. But I just feel that someone who's making out that they are your friend in your workplace, the next minute they're behind your back gossiping, talking about you. So I'm picking up with some Pisceans in August who may... Uh, be experienced something along those lines. I also feel, because I'm drawn here now, if I can just lift this card up again, there's an egg here with its eyes closed, just out on its own. And with this black entity here, now I'm looking on the love, uh, the love aspect here, where I do feel that some Pisceans out there who are in a relationship with someone I do feel that you may even have picked up on your own feelings about this relationship, that there's been a lack of trust uh, over the last couple of months. So much I feel, and I hate to say it, but I do feel that some of my Pisceans out there um, with the partnerships, etc., I do feel there's been some kind of an affair element um, to the fact that I think that some Pisceans I've got an inkling of this, um, but they don't want to face up to the fact that their partner or boyfriend or whatever it is, girlfriend, is playing away sort of thing, closing their eyes to it, don't want to take that information on board. But again, I do feel that it's important for me to get that message across um, because, you know, I, I do pick up on this dark entity here. Um, whether it's in work or, you know, relationships, etc. Um, and I also pick up as well, some Pisces in August may be looking to change their job because of this aspect that they're not feeling happy, that they have been struggling at work, um, you know, not feeling connected with the people they're working with. So it's saying that they, you know, they're looking for other jobs, but just be aware that... Um, you know, you could have seen a fantastic job and you think, yes, yes, I'm going to go for that. But it's saying don't put all your eggs 
in the same basket because if you see here look there's a, a clutch of eggs there but it's saying you know make sure you keep your options open and plant a few opportunities you know around so I'll just pull the next clarifying card see what we've got here and it's a lovely card um, magic prayer and if you can see on this card there's a female with her eyes closed you know um, which follows on from what I was saying on this part of the reading with the relationship side of things as I said I think some Pisces out there in August you know I'm gonna have to address this it's all gonna come to a head where you've thought no I'm not gonna believe that I don't believe my other half's having an affair or you know I've got an inkling but no no I'm gonna you know not pay attention to it but you know I think August for your own self-worth you need to get this into the open. Um, I do feel that August for the Pisces I'm reading today, it's a very strong connection around the love aspect and where the family looks like it's a normal family and everything's, you know, all hunky-dory and it's getting on and the partnership's fine and that, I do feel that there is some deceit going on behind your closed eyes and if you look at that card if I hold these two cards up together the egg in the field has got its eyes closed you know doesn't want to know what's going on here in front of it and this card the magic prayer magic prayer card in this deck is saying that anything that um, you manifest or think you put out into the universe you know those thoughts you know can sort of come true sort of thing manifest so make sure august is the time for you to address this issue because as i say everything looks fine family looks you know the relationship looks all honky dory but here there's this bad egg so that's what i'm picking up with you pisces uh, for august so if i look at the angel number 21 we've got on this one uh, on this card and angel number 21 um, it's saying that the angels are reminding you to be aware of your thoughts which obviously follows on for that card there be sure you only have positive thoughts and think about the things you desire it's saying you need to be optimistic about the future and maintain your balance um, your attitude will help you achieve your desired goals and obviously if you're going through with the attitude of you know I'm closing my eyes to this brush it under the carpet maybe it'll all go away um, I just feel that you need to if you have got that niggling feeling behind you that you know there is something going on underhanded that you, is August is the time it needs to come to the forefront uh, as you know I sort of savant on these cards prior to doing the readings and on this one um, like I say I, I was drawn to the the words at the end when I wrote and I've sort of you know put these poems to to each star sign for the month of August so you Pisces I came out with open your eyes to see around you face the truth and see the light stand in the power of your own self-worth and remember you should never lose sight on what you want to make you happy now to reap what you have sown time to harvest your dreams and wishes no, you can do this on your own. So that poem obviously covers what I've said here. You need to open your eyes, um, whether that's on the love side of things, with the relationship, as I mentioned, or on the other side of the coin for my lovely Piscean people in August, the work-related issues. Um, as I say, that there is some backstabbing some gossiping behind your back in the work front now you either take that on and, and address it straight to those people I don't care what rank what level you know these people that people work within in a in a work uh, environment never ever uh, be scared to speak up uh, find your voice air your opinions please or offend life's too short to go um a long life you know um being a victim really being a victim that's what i want to say on this being a victim because i know there's people out there 
regardless of zodiac sign really who go to work every day and they don't fit in they feel like they're an outsider but they have to go because they've got to pay their bills etc um but if for any reason your job or the people in your work are making you feel so you know unhappy or stress or no job is worth that honestly no job is worth that no person within the work environment is worth that you know there's there's bullies everywhere so august my friends for piscians <laughs> you need to uh, deal with deal with these problems you know get it out there in the forefront and address it speak your voice let your feelings be known um you know it could be that the fact that you speak out at work and your boss or partners or work colleagues had no idea how you were feeling so you just get it out there and things you know can go on a onto a better path for you so yeah that is what i've got for my lovely piscians for the month of august thank you again for tuning in it's a new channel as i say uh, so there's not much content on at the moment but you know please try and uh, roll with me um i'll be happy if you hit the subscribe button so you get further notifications of my readings in the future but yeah pisces thank you and i'll see you next month take care bye